hi you guys welcome back to my channel um spiritual justice gym like share subscribe but most of all take in the knowledge and enlightenment of god of god <laughs> okay um um we're gonna come from revelations 13 and 18 today it says you need wisdom to understand the number of the beast. But if you are smart enough, you can figure this out. It's number is 666. Six, six. A lot of people are scared of this number in real life. <laughs> and I'm not scared to get 666 on my receipt or anything like that. Because um that's not what the Bible meant by that is. <laughs> that's not what he's talking about when um that's not what God is talking about. That's not what the Bible Jesus is talking about when they talk about the number of the man is six six six. And they're not talking about all your receipts or anything like that. There's no negative energy when it comes off to that. The whole point um of that scripture was so that you can identify the people of Satan, which I have been steady teaching about. Is the devil mindset. It's just people who have the devil mindset. And the Bible. Oh I should have looked at the other scripture. But I didn't. Um, where it talks about um, the beast. And uh, the devil. All he come to is lie. Kill. Destroy. And cheat. And all that stuff. Y'all know what scripture. I probably didn't even say it all the way right. But for you guys that know. You know where to go look it up. And um, you can leave it down in the comment area. For other people to reference. Um. But it's just simply talking about people who are bought and paid for by the devil. It's talking about people. What I've noticed and what God has shown me is a lot of people in the music industry that's bought and paid for. And I sing a lot the music industry because even in the Bible, if you reference back when he's talking about Lucifer is the. um, uh, What was he saying? The head of music or. Something to that effect. You guys know what I'm talking about. But um, that's what I'm picking up. Like, even back then, it says uh, the the devil, Lucifer, was beautiful. He was an angel. He was really beautiful. Um, he had an angelic voice, too. He, he was the head of music. So, we have to understand and use the wisdom of God and our discernment to know what the Spirit of God is talking about, right? So... This um these are this is what he's talking about. When he identifies um the the double minded people, those people that sh you know lie, cheat, still they they pretend like they're in a God side or using a God mind, but the whole time behind the scenes they're in their devil energy. They're in that pretend energy, like false light beings, like narcissists. They're false light beings. This narcissistic personality, they're false light beings. Their mind is so corrupt and has fallen so far from grace that everything is everybody else's fault. Everything pertain that um that they do is not their own fault. And that's the that's the devil have their mind. It, it, you could call it a disorder, but it's just simply he's marking his people. The number of the, the 666, the number of a man, of a person, meaning each person, it can be one, two, three millions or not. But the Bible talks about the, the number of, uh, of the people that's for Satan too. Because remember, when he cast Satan out from heaven, he fell to the earth. And uh, the angels were sad. Everybody was sad because he he had fallen to the earth. And they knew that mankind, that a, a lot of mankind wasn't going to survive the devil. And that's how they became the, 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 the um, um, that's how we, we can learn to, um, mark, to notice. I'm sorry. I'm picking up a lot of messages right now. I'm so sorry. Let me just give spirit a minute to, to give me clarity. They said that's how you know to how to discern Satan's from God's people. You have to understand it's all about the energy. It's nothing what somebody does or or, or, or it's not particular action or deed. It's the, the energy behind the action, the thought, and deed. Just like somebody can put out a love song, but it'd be full of demonic entities in that song and energy, and you act out. 
it's simply that it's just that that thing no matter what um just like a narcissist they be so nice on the outside they're so loving and full you think they're full of love and light on the inside and they're not they're empty they're shells so it's that same thing you have to be mindful what you take into your spirit and who's putting in there the devil can only fool the elect for so long um i'm getting this download where because i already know who the Antichrist is. I know the, it's a it's a number of them. Is he's already here? He and he's in. I won't say the music industry as in. How can I put this? Because it's so tedious. Because it goes so many different ways. He is a, when Satan fell from heaven. He became a man. Let's just make that point blank clear. He became a man. Okay. So um. The Antichrist is is Satan, who is the, the head of all against God, the God mindset. And then his people that he controls that are against God. You know what I'm saying? So when he fell, he fell to earth, meaning um that he fell with the with music, with all these 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 I won't say that. I hate to say the gifts, but the devil have gifts. I don't even like to give him no credit, but let's just be, let fact be fact. The gifts and everything that the devil had, he, he came with. You got to understand that, that he's not super slow or dumb either. So the devil war against God's people to strengthen them. So when the devil is warring against you, God is strengthening you and he will strengthen you because he'll, he'll show you where you're weak at and he'll show you where you're strong at. So don't ever be afraid of the, the devil and his people. God will give you strength to overcome. Okay. I just want to put that out there. But when, de when the Satan fell from heaven, he, he, he became a man, a physical in flesh. He has a, a name, a birthday, a, a birth certificate. This is what I'm trying to tell you. He has a name. He has a birthday. He has a birth certificate and he does not dwell. He's not born in the United States. Let's just make that clear. He's not here in the United States. Unless he travels and go back, but he's not, he was not born in the United States. He was not born in these 50 states of the United States. I don't, I, I don't know how clear can I make that. So, um, these people that's putting out this high frequency music is what you need to be aware of. Yes. High frequency music is good. And you can tell I'm an advocate for, I have been advocating for it for a long time now, but you have to be aware of the people who's making these beats and muses, you have to have discernment of spirit. You God's people, God, God say it is very inclusive. It is very, very imperative that you guys, us as God people, as God fan people, God minded people, it is very vital for us to have our discernment of spirit at this time. The devil, we are out on warfare. Warfare is at the highest it's ever been. So, when you listen to these high frequency music, anything, it could be anything with frequency in it. But most, so he's angered, his, anchored himself into high frequency music. Hear me, hear me. He has anchored himself into that community. And when you listen to this man's music, the devil, Satan, he's in an entity. He's in a, um, um, how do I say entity? I'm sorry. He's in a fuse, uh, a physical human 3D body at this time. And while he's in this body, he, he transferred his spirit from person, his thoughts and ideals using this, this high frequency music from person to person to person to control them because when you when you when you open up your soul to to this high frequency music he's putting downloads and doors and and different things into your spirit so that he can give you the information that he wants you to have and it's not coming from god you think it's god you think it's all because it feels good but you're connecting to him and he wants you to feel good so you can keep doing it. it's like a drug you keep connecting to this music hear me hear what i'm saying ask god to reveal to you who this man is ask God to reveal to you is imperative it's imperative for, for the saints the chosen ones to know that he has anchored himself into